84. Tony Eccles, 86, but it was Wesley's finishing that was the better of the two players. Nine out of 20, which was an Im impressive return. 45% checkout rate for Harms. And if he does that again today, he's going to be a tough guy to beat. Anything oh over 40%, my. that's the sort of level that they judge by. Anything over 40%, they're going to be very happy with that. Fit young fella as well. Not going to be worried about the hot temperature up there on the stage. 59. Fifty nine. Wesley with a marginal advantage in this first leg of the first set. So a quick look at the scoreboard. Six days. Leaves himself a finish. He's left himself on a finish, but not the one he'd have wanted. And Eccles, if he can get a big score on this visit, he's going to put himself in a great position. Wesley, you require 161. Treble 20, first then for Wesley Harms. Treble 17 next. And we'll come back up. One on the end, 23. But the previous visit of Eccles has really set this one up now. 107 to give him first blood. He can still do it with treble 20 and tops. Now, a test of nerve. Yeah, that's been shot. Passes absolutely with Terrific flying level. colours. Terrific start for the birthday boy. Second leg, like, it's going to throw first. Game on. First leg against the darts for Tony Eccles. Double top. He's a double 16 man generally, going by how he played that first round tie against Daryl Fitton. He only had one dart at double 20 in the entire match. 64. Left himself on double 16 more often than not. But hits tops at the first time of asking. And gets his nose in front against Wesley Harms early on here. One on the end, 35. Harms twice a semi-finalist, as you were hearing a little bit earlier on. Tony O'Shea had a liking for matches against him. 6-5 and 6-4, denying him. This year, seeded 12. 98. Well, having reached the last four on his debut in 2012 and then following it up, he became only the fifth man ever to reach the semi-finals in his first two years. One of players that he emulated, Messrs. Reese Lowe, Burnett and Fordham. Some four ball that, they all went on to win the title here. So the old men's good for Wesley Harms. 58. It's had his moments this year, Harms. John Walton, Robbie Green, Gary Robson and Jim Williams on his way to the Scottish Open. That's not a bad list of scalps. And has a victory this year against 41. Stephen Bunting, or last year, I should say, 2013. That was in the WDF World Cup singles. Micah here, as always, shouting Wesley on. Well, this can be done. Not with a dart like that. Needed the treble 17 for the bullseye, so all he can do now is set it up, and he didn't need that. A little bit unlucky, just kissed off the barrel. Hits the treble 19, treble 16 now. Bullseye for a 123. Yeah, that's been shot, and the second one. What a start. Both players winning a leg against the darts. Harms in brilliant fashion there. 123, not his biggest of the tournament so far. And as always, Sparky, emotionless as he takes the darts out of the board. He's a cool customer, isn't he? You don't see too much reaction. One and A few players, and we've talked about it earlier in the week, John, that you, you fancy your chances playing poker against. Not Wesley. Yeah, he wouldn't be wearing the dark glasses, would he? Doesn't need 58. 
and now a full-time data Sparky formerly an electrician one on an own forte and showing the sort of form that's going to get him a decent payday they want to get through this though take his place in the next round Eccles getting the break in the openings leg and now two in again one on an own 23 One on their own forte. 100, 140, 140. Wesley's first three visits to the hockey. Leaves himself on a potential 12 data. And look at this from Tony Eccles as he looks for his first One maximum. Left himself on a finish, but Harms now. 121, looking to take this one out. That's a great first dart. Double 18 with that outer ball. Oh, yeah, brilliant! Yeah, 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 yeah. Superb yeah. checkout yeah, yeah. from Harms. Four he's averaging close on 105, and he's now 2 1 up. One on and 37. Three legs in, and it's already a match of the highest quality. Great checkouts, fantastic scoring as well. And always with the ride of it, it is very early in the game. But those hugely impressive the checkout stats perfect well that kind of helps the averages doesn't it 81 clinical one on the four time Not quite sure what that was. One on their own fourteen. Teen Wolf and Robocop. All the superheroes here today. One Party on atmosphere one. starting Jerry to ramp up. As Darth Vader, he's here as well. Who's the guy with the hat? I don't know, but he wishes he'd made an effort. Well, for the uh, treble 14 Wesley there, Wesley is on a finish. Treble 17 will leave him bull. Just a shade away for Wesley Harms. So Eccles looking to square off the match here with the darts after making it two apiece. Double 16 now. Oh, minimal adjustment. Not a bad marker. Oh dear. Oh dear. Now that could hurt because Harms can now take the first set. Treble 16. So another single 16. Well, he went eight for tops instead. Yeah, Hits it brilliantly. Great set. adjustment. Wesley and Wesley Harms set, takes first the first set with a minimum of fuss. Lost the first leg against the darts. In next to no time, he finds himself 1 0 up on the back of it. Unflappable, isn't he? And a quality double. One on one. One on their own four time. One on ninety five. Six days. These two players have met once before. It was uh, back in April in the Polish Open. Tony victorious on that occasion. 96. Must have slipped his memory. He was saying in that interview beforehand that they'd not played before. Well, that's a good thing if you're a sporting champion. If someone beats you, let it 
go from your memory, that can't be a bad thing. 121, Wesley Uribe, 170. Hold that third dart a little bit. Wesley, top of the shot, 170. First dart is in. Looks to see what Tony is on. And Boy, that sets himself up at 72. Uribe, well, we've all seen this one done. It's Shanghai. Oh, dear, dear, dear. That is a loose one. He'll be kicking himself with that. And Harms already one Monty. set to the good. Now with a terrific Wesley opportunity after a poor visit from Eccles to take the opening leg of this second set. Good marker. Six days. Well, you'd have thought that one was destined to take its place. Bullseye is looking for here. Oh, he bounced out. Not too sure whether it actually bounced out of the ball. The but his left arm's double six here. Now this is tough. Yeah, it has been shot. Cool. The Coolness Wesley personified. Eccles can only watch and wonder if it's starting to go wrong. He's had chances and not Second taken line, them. It's Wesley the 12 first. Game on. So a leg against the darts for Wesley Harms, having won the first set. Has his nose in front in the second. 83. That is an idiosyncratic way of playing 72 as well. And goes for the treble 20 to leave himself double six. We saw that a couple of times in the match against Paul Jennings. Probably not with a view to leaving himself on double three. Not too many people like the prospect of that one. Unless you're particularly diminutive. I was going to say, it is our MC Richard Ashdown's favourite double. For Six primarily eight. that reason. A little harsh. He's a little fella. Comes down the Tony, just to make sure that the second one didn't come out of the board. It was uh, just clawing on. Ninety six. One hundred and fourteen. Yet to get a maximum in this match. Wesley Harms. But he'll come back with 1 1 8 now. It's good from Eccles, but Harms now can go 2 up. Treble 20 will leave him double 19. So double 19 for a 2 0 lead in the second set. 18. Tony requires 66. 12 would leave him. Tops, double 16. 15. Leaving him double eight. Well, Where's the arms for two nil. Only just missed with his first attempt at double 19. Yeah, that's game shot. And the second well, he's line. taken that Where's out. Like it's the he went for a six with the first dart, went in the, the single ten by mistake, but it was a great adjustment from Harms to uh, hit the double 14. Everything well, going the my. way of the unflappable Dutchman up to this point. Five BDO ranking titles in his career, including the Scottish Open back in February. In fact, One on an these two, the last two winners of this competition, or of that competition, I beg your pardon, the Scottish Open. Eccles had a spell playing in PDC tournaments for five years from 2007. And in that time, had a win over James Wade in the 2008 World Grand Prix. Wade will uh, thank me for reminding people about that. It's a 301 apiece after six starts each. One on the own, 14. 
one six one is a finish theoretically for Eccles. The game is starting to slide away. Six starts from here though. Paul Hogan hit a 161 against Scott Mitchell yesterday. Tony unable to replicate it. But in a good position here, a leg in which he's got the darts. He knows that he'll be back for 68, and he also knows that he simply cannot Sixth afford day. to miss it. Tony and he well, now knows six darts well, but he's got six darts from here. Double 16. Yeah, it has been shot on the third line. Tony Eccles. Four rackets, wrestling the 21st. Pretty Sixty-six. One on the round, twenty-one. Arms, of course, with the darts now, and uh, in a position where he can claim the second set. Well, that makes things look a little rosier for Eccles, doesn't it? He's taken the darts and he's away. Brilliant. Great response from Wesley Harms. Just when he had to provide one. He will be the first. Had a check out, albeit that it's a big one. And a leg that would give him a 2 0 lead if he can take out 154. 59. Very little between the two players in terms of averages. But there could be two sets between them in a moment. But a loose first start from Wesley. He won't be very happy with darts two or three either. Eccles will have had 141 a few times when he's been practicing. But not this time. It's the one that they left on when they're looking for maximum. Wesley, you require 109. Treble 19 would leave double 16. 57. Still, Wesley forced to set it up after the first start was wide of its target. So Eccles on 56, treble 16 for double four. Yeah, it has been shot in the foreground. May the falls be with you. And they were with Tony Eccles just when he needed it. It's a leg against the darts. He saves the set. That was a Ken Bruce commentary moment. One on ride. May the fours be with you. A moment and a memory I'll take away from this particular commentary. Six day. Got a game on our hands again here. Eccles takes this one out. Serving. He's got the darts. Back on level playing. He's got the advantage. One on right. Terrific first dart from Eccles. Oohs and ahs from the crowd. They thought they were going to get another maximum there. Not to be, but 100. Solid. Seventy-eight. Oh, not the time for a 41. And Tony's cousin Lynn looking on. Applause of encouragement. Crucial leg this in the context 45. of the whole match. Will it be 2-0? This is an Will important be... sorry, this is an important visit as well. Trying to set it up here. Oh, just 
by a fraction. The long side, the, the wrong side of the wire. Excellent scoring, by and large. Fantastic scoring in the first nine as well. 59. Check out percentages. Also pretty impressive. But the bottom line is Eccles has to take 157 here, which he can't do now. Mine Wesley Harp's highest Wesley finish up to this point in the tournament, 123. And it still is. One on the end, Big Forte. chance here for Tony Eccles. Tony Tremendous last point. dart that was from Eccles to treble 18, giving him this chance. And now double 16. This is what he's earned, this opportunity. And he's taken yeah, it! Back on level time. terms! Tony Look how much it means! It's one set apiece. First half, first half, it's Wesley Gatron players. King on. Well, it might be his last tournament. I wonder if he's reconsidering the decision to retire at the age of 44. That second set, lost the first two legs of it, up against it. Nerveless double 16 to win the third leg. Brilliant double four to win the fourth. And then it hits a, another fantastic double 16 to win the deciding leg. 85. Tied up at 1-1. One, one. Looked as though he might be going 2-0 down. Good checkout stats from both guys there. Over 50%. What on that own 40 there for Tony Eccles. You can see of the three legs we've had so far have been won by checkouts of 81 or more. One on that own 25. Arms has had a 123, Eccles a 107. And we're still only nine legs in. Seventy-seven. Eccles has clawed his way back into this. He admitted he was just a, a little bit lucky, as he put it, in his first round victory. He got the doubles right. Didn't get the scores as he would have wanted. Well, he's upped his game well, on that particular respect. That's terrific throwing, though, from Harms. Good as a maximum. Ninety-nine. Wesley, you require 45. After the good work of that 174, 13 leaves him double, 16. 13. Well, his finishing was excellent in the first set, not so in the second, and that's carried on into the third. So another chance for Eccles for his fourth leg in a row. Treble 16 for double 16. Well, he hit double 16 to win the last set, double 16 to win a leg against the darts. Not this time. That was a big dart. You tell how much it meant to him, and he thought it was in when he let it go. And now Harms can punish that. Well, you've got to put it down as an error. Yeah, it and he does so. precisely that. Wendy Harms. Second like is a third. I wonder how much Eccles might Keep look on. back and rue that particular moment. Got to put it out of his mind. That's a great first dart. Ninety-nine. Well, no man has come further to get to the Mind lakeside than divine. Mike Day here from Auckland. And his wife here as well. You'd stay for an extra day or two, wouldn't you? To... I certainly would if I'd come from Auckland. I've never been a great fan of jet lag. Six day. He looks fairly chirpy, though, doesn't he? Oh, he's in great form. Freely admitted that his achievement was just getting here in the first place. For Wesley. Two-time semi-finalist in the last two years. And he wants that little bit more. Eccles has to scrap it out again. Took that second set when, for much of its duration, it looked as though it was going to go the other way. 
hung on in there and took his chance. Harms now in the ascendancy once more in this third set. 36. Wesley with an advantage of 64 after nine darts apiece. Tony redressing the balance here. One on an M40. And Eccles will have six darts from there because Harms, all he can do is try and hit big numbers here to put some pressure on. Needs trebles. That's one. I think he's staying there. One on one. Well, he'd have hoped Tony for more. To 117. 117 and again, pressure applied by Harms. Single five. A few times that first dart has just missed its target under pressure. And he's had to move right across the hockey here to 26. Try and get Wesley the treble ends over the single ones. And 93 now for Wesley Harms. How's he gonna go? Goes the bull route. That's a 13. Trouble 20 for double 10. Can't get it. So Eccles 50 breathes again. Turning your require 91. Might go for the ball, might go for treble 17. Excellent first start. Nine double 16. Just the double 16. Yeah, that's Another the excellent check out so from the Harley Paul Viper. So like it's, the first. King it's one all and one all after an excellent 91 check out. Just get the impression Harms is starting to. Slightly outscore Eccles at this stage, although not too much between them in terms of averages. But Eccles is sticking with it and he's withstanding the pressure and he's scrapping as he did in the last set and he's still in there. Well, those, doubles that count. Those checkout percentages, both superior to their first round performances, particularly in Tony's case, where he averaged 32% in the victory against Daryl Fitton. One on right. It's also been significant, John, the number of times that uh, the throws have been broken. That game against Fitton, Eccles held his throw eight out of nine times. Today, so far, only three out of six. 43. Well, that's a poor visit from Eccles. Now, Harms just needs to settle down here and try and turn the screw with darts like that. One on right. It's a good solid ton, needed that. Ninety-nine. So one treble in his first nine darts in this leg so far for Tony Eccles. Arms a hundred ahead after nine darts apiece. Ninety-seven. And another excellent cover shot from the Dutchman. Ninety-nine. Wesley, you require one hundred and twenty-two. One twenty-two him for Wesley Harms. Treble 18. Didn't quite get it in. 54. 68 when he comes back. Eccles, what he give, or what he would have given for a 180. Not there now. Oh, that's a bit unlucky. That is unlucky. Good darts, just the wrong side of the 60. wire. Loose last Wesley one though. Requires 68. Double top for Wesley Harms to move 2 1 ahead. Tony he would expect to be back, but you never know. He needs a Hollywood moment. And it's not quite there. Good cover shot. 94. But this Wesley is a great chance now 20. for Harms to make it two legs to one with the throw. Double 10. Fives. Oh dear, dear, dear. 15. Tony that is a bit of a mess. 66. And this really is an opportunity. One that he could do with taking. 20. Double 16. To steal the leg for Tony Eccles. And that is a big missed opportunity. He was miles behind five. in this leg. Had a chance to win it. Might yet win it. One double two for Wesley Harms. 
Yeah, it has been shown in the third line. Wesley Perilous, Perilously close to the trouble, wasn't it, with that first dance at the, at the one. Just the, wrong, just the right side of the wire as he looked at it. But 2 1 Harms with the throw. 93. Forty-four. That was interesting in that last leg. Wesley on twenty. Missed the double ten. Missed the double five. Left himself on five. One dart to go. Some players would have bust from there. Give himself a shot at double ten. He elected instead. One on the end. Forty. To stay where he was. Perfectly vindicated one in that decision one. by taking out the double two. It was a strange one, but he'll just say, well, look at the scoreboard. Absolutely. Nine to eight. Good thinking from Eccles there, left himself on the potential checkout. Well, I don't 58. think he's going to have to go for it, he surely won't. Top of the shot. 170 now the only finish that can take the highest 92. check out prize away from the magnificent finish that we saw earlier this afternoon 167 one on row Tony requires 78 78 then six starts at it 20 leaves double top Fifty-eight. A little bit jittery, double ten when he returns. Harms won't be too worried about this because he'll come back knowing that he's got the darts in the next 59. leg and that will give him the Tony opportunity. So double ten for Eccles. Yeah, it has been shot. It's two two. Tony Eccles. One set apiece. And Harms now the favourite to make it 2 1. Well, the last hit went to a deciding leg as well, which Tony Eccles 85. won with a double 16. And Wesley with the darts in the final leg of this third set. Two fellas have gone off the boil a bit, Jim. The scoring has just slid a little. And both of them now averaging less than 90. Having started brilliantly. You see that uh, statistics right. which confirm the impression that he's just struggling to gain some momentum up there now. 41. And that's been borne out by 85 and 41 for Wesley at the start of this crucial leg. A couple of trebles for Tony here. Puts him in control. Look at big pivotal moments in matches, don't Six you? And this eight. is an important one. This is a really key leg, this one, which is being enjoyed by a big afternoon crowd here at the lakeside. One on the end, 21. First time that we've had afternoon crowds here at the uh, lakeside on weekdays. They have been, all been excellent, and uh, if you've never experienced this particular venue, I urge you to get yourself down. I'm not advocating sickies in any shape or form. Surely not. You've still got a couple of hours of the working day to get your place here tomorrow by legitimate means. If you wear a good enough, uh, wear a good enough fancy dress, nobody would recognise you anyway. Nobody knows who Darth Vader is. Not even Luke Skywalker knew who Darth Vader was. Turned out to be Alec Guinness in the end, didn't it? <laughs> 99. Sorry if I've just given it away to anybody who's not seen it. <laughs> 95. He's enjoying it. Who is that? Who is that man? Don't know. Hasn't had much to drink though. 46. To the business in hand Wesley of a crucial fifth leg in this third set. 99 for Wesley Harms. Still with the advantage at this point. Double 10 now for Harms after a brilliant second dart. Yeah, oh, what a finish! Under pressure! Time.
A 99 checkout, just when you needed it, and it's worth the set. It was a real struggle, that last set. Eccles was in there battling right up to the conclusion, but that double from Wesley Harms, well, it gives him the advantage again. Two sets to one up now, first to four, will take a place in the next round, twice a beaten semi-finalist. On course to getting the victory he wants. One on one. Forty. That was the first leg out of the. Uh, last nine that Tony Eccles didn't have a dart at a double so he is getting chances 55 he's getting chances his accuracy on that double 16 is still pretty tidy Stephen Bunting enjoying some time in the crowd and he was having his photograph taken happily with uh, his fans and he's gonna be happy with a day's work well done what a run. said he was gonna relax with a couple of Couple of sherbets after he'd finished. Michael with a smile on her face now. Looked a little bit nervous 26. earlier. Her expression is belying the way a man is playing, even if Wesley's isn't as ever. That's a loose dart. He was looking for 18s. 44. One on the end, Solid from Hans. Right back in the leg. Ninety-eight. Leaves himself on Shanghai twenties. And Tony will be back to have a look at that in a moment. Two one to Harms. One on the end, four Everything effectively Tony going with the darts up to this point. 20. I think we've all managed this on occasions on a Sunday lunchtime. Not usually watched by a big crowd like this in a moment like this. Pressure. One on and one. he just buckles Wesley again. 55. 15 tops for Wesley Harms. Double 10. It's a big duck. Leg against the throw that he hasn't been 25. able to take that chance. And now Eccles back with exactly the same target in his eye line. Double ten for Tony Eccles. Oh, pressure. Pressure. Yeah, it has been shot. You'd never know. Tony Eccles. Excellent third down from Tony Eccles to hold. It's becoming just a wee bit painful to watch at times because they're both feeling it. Average is coming down, the pressure's on, so much at stake. One on the down one. Both in from Wesley Harms, couldn't get the uh, third in. Good marker. Is that what it is? That's a marker pen, is it? Yellow crayon. All oh, right. Would that not be top of your list of fancy dress yeah, I mean, outfits what, for the lakeside? What is the what is the thought process? You work up, wake right. up in the morning, and think, right, I'm going to the darts. Now, what am I going to go as? I know, I'll go as a marker pen. If only he had a companion what dressed right. similarly. Oh, he has. I accuse you of insider dealing there. <laughs> They'll have green babies. <laughs> 81. Wesley, you require so, 161 61. checkout. Can't be done now. One on one. We'll be back, though, for 61. Three sets have gone with the dart so far, and the uh, two legs in this fourth set looking like going with the darts but and it's a big but 
It's only looking at the scoreboard. So he's on 99 after those first two darts. He's working out how best to apply some pressure. One on the end, leaves himself on 80. Right then, Harms, 61. He's looking for 25 as the opening darts, and he's just uh, the cogs turning. He's on 45, takes five for tops. 41. And he hasn't got the dart Tony he wanted. 80. Against the darts. Oh, a loose first one. Needed the treble 13 for tops. 47. Wesley got to Uruguay take those chances. 20. Got to take those chances if you're going to win. It's a double tap. This yeah, time he hits it right in the, the middle line. of the bed. Wesley Arms. Third the 12 first. Game that double ten's been kind to him. It won him the third set on that 99 checkout. Hits the double ten again. 43. It's also been kind to him in the respect that Tony's missed it a couple of times at crucial points. Looking for his second maximum. The crowd love it. And talk about how quickly the tide might change. Tony with the throw here, 43 and 58. And Wesley has already filled her up once. Here he goes again. The fourth perfect dart of this leg, the fifth, One and nine, the sixth one, bounced nine. out. And you go back, don't you, to that missed opportunity at the end of the last leg. Eccles really should have taken that one. And Harms now suddenly Six, is on a little bit of a roll. Could have been a nine darter. Well, just a shade more luck. And he would have been back for his last three. 99. And a shot at £52,000, which is the bounty on a nine data this year. That'd be handy. Got to wire, got to wire a few plugs to get 52 grand, doesn't it? Let's see what it can do for 102. Can still be done. Bull would leave double 16, but that's just a three. 42. Still got time on his side, though. And plenty of it, and remember, this is a leg against the Eccles' throat. Sixty. He looks unable to recover Where's from a poor start to this 60. leg, so Harms with 60 here, and this is another crucial leg in the match. Double top. Double 10 now. Well, he hasn't hit it this time. But Eccles only getting 60 on his previous visit, leaving himself on a big finish, 146. And too much once more. The man from the northeast. Just not happening for him here at the minute. Double 10 then for 2 1. Yeah, that's game shot in the third round. Harms two sets to one up. And now with the advantage in this set as well, 2-1. And now looking to serve it out to make it 3-1. That's the advantage here. One on looking to make it time. pay, third one just slipping. Eighty-five. Wesley's big scoring is now superior to Tony's. It was pretty level uh, a set and a half ago. You always, got, you always got the impression, didn't you, though, that Tony earlier on in the match he was kind of hanging on in there and feeding on scraps. Harms just looks as though he has, as that statistic showed, as the greatest scoring power. But Eccles trying to prove that statistics don't always tell the story. 40. Wesley Fane for often wearing a glove when he's playing, such as the heat of the lakeside stage. Absolutely no need for that in this particular tournament. One on the end, five, Seldom see one. it here at the lakeside. It's uh, other events really where sometimes the glove will come out for Wesley. No finish, one seven six clearly, and uh, Tony's a difficult one as well. Sixty-eight. Tony, you require one hundred and forty-five. 
Good first start. Decided to go 19s rather than 15s. 93. Where's the you require 108? This for a 3 1 lead in sets. And now this is a big chance that you feel Tony Eccles has to take. 52. This to stay in the set for that leg back against the darts. Double 16, two darts at it. The pressure intensifies. Another one of those will do him. Double eight, shuffles across the hockey and yeah, nails it. And Excellent round. darts from Tony, Tony Eccles. Eccles. And he follows his Good worst darts. leg of the day with his most crucial to date. He knew the routine, didn't he? Two, two, and Eccles with the darts. One on the All he needs is tons, really, to make it very difficult for Harms, and he's done better. Eleven. Horrible visit from Harms. It's the fascination of darts, isn't it, Jim? It can all change so quickly. One on the round, four time. More than in any other sport, the margins are infinitesimally small. One on round. Two 140s from Tony Eccles. And he's well in control 16. of this decisive fifth leg in the fourth set. One on row. 161 can be done. The time on his side. And at least six from here. Might have more. 81. Well, that's quality. Eighty two two beckons One for one. Eccles. Now, you require eight can eight. can his nerve hold? Double sixteen, two darts at it to tie it up at two two. Yeah, he only needs the one. The quarter, Tony Eccles. His favourite finish of Blanches again. Four fascinating Eccles. sets of darts, and we're no closer to knowing who will be going through to the quarter final. Eccles maintaining a 45% checkout rate and taking the leg under real pressure there. It's 2 2, first to four. Who's he money on now? When the match started, Harms was the 9 to 4 on favourite. Eccles, One special man, day for 25. him. And he wants to make it that little bit more special. Birthday boy, 44 years old. I think One if he wins this and carries on, maybe that uh, suggestion he was going to retire might be just put on the back burner for a little while. Hasn't always been One able to do himself one. justice at the lakeside. Is that reflecting the noise One in the one. arena? That noisier it is, the more lights. The more lights light up. It's a very good piece of uh, technology, isn't it? Yeah. I'm impressed with that. It's not your average t shirt. <laughs> One on one. Wired for sound. <laughs> Fourteen. No finish, of course. Traveller be handy. Manoeuvring his way across the hockey and coming down. Nine oh, great cover seven. shot. One on the end, 40. Tony requires 79. Well, the last time Harms had the darts, Eccles broke him. He's got another chance. Take advantage at the start of this fifth set here. 
You see the way that he threw the third dart into the ball in frustration, that he was not happy with himself. Harms went for the 25. 11 leaves him tops. 41. Some way away. Tony, you require 40. Earl Eccles. Another opportunity to pinch a leg against the darts. Oh dear. Oh, that was a big one. Look at that. Wesley, you require Kicking 20. himself. How many times have I done that in practice? And how could I do that now of all times? Double five. Yeah, it has been shot in the first line. That hurts, Second Eccles. Line. Second line, it's Tony the throw first. Game on. Two darts to win the leg against the throw. And he couldn't take them. 99. Tony very much a double 16 man, as we've mentioned. Double top has not been his friend so far since that very 16. first leg. I don't think he's hit it once. Did have a decent year. He reached the quarterfinals of the England Masters uh, in July, losing 4 3 in the Hartlepool Derby to Paul Jennings. Nine ranking titles in his career, seven of them in his first spell with the BDO. The one that stretches back to success over Tony David in the British Open back in 2002. And it has said, as we've been mentioning, that this is destined to be his one last ride. ever tournament. He's going to pack it all in. So it could be, conceivably, 20 minutes from retirement here. But it could be four days one away from glory. Harms third maximum. Getting a bit of momentum and revving up the atmosphere a little. It's fifth, the fifth 180 of the match. It's not been well, a classic this one, time. but we knew Western it was going to be a tight one. Bobby George was saying that before it began. Look for this to be a real scrap, and it's showing that it's going to go all the way. One hundred and thirty-seven. Tony Uribe, one hundred and two. Great darts from Harms, but will they be in vain? Went for the ball, which would have left him 16, 62. as it is. Harms is back to take a two-leg lead in this fifth set. Double 12, the shot. Now it's double six. Now it's double three. Has hit it before, 18. but he doesn't hit it this time when it matters. Oh, dear. 14. Eccles, then, to hold his throw. Scrappy sort of leg, this one. Yeah, and, and he gets it with his 17th dart. Like it's one leg on. apiece now. Eighty five. And still, everything going with the throw. And seven legs out of the twenty one so far, where there has been a break. Nine, cancel each other out up to this point. And players have found it easier to hold as the game has gone on. One it's getting one. distinctly warm in here, and it'll get a little bit hotter yet as well. Another evening of terrific entertainment yet to come. Forty-two. Saw the venom from the Viper there as he picked one his darts one. out of the board. In the wake of that 42. There's that idiosyncratic throwing style. Reminiscent of uh, the head of the Viper one striking one his prey as he releases the dart. Excellent cover dart there from Tony. One on row. Not going for the maximum. Well, going for the 177 59. instead. Arms on a finish of 116. Treble 20 would have left him double 18. 16. As it is, Tony Eccles Tony back on 84. 84. Single 20, so 14. Leaves the bullseye. Oh, 51. 
Well, that Wesley, wasn't really 56. by the standards he would have expected. Not really very close. Double top then for Wesley Harms. Double ten. Yeah, it has been shot the third line. Well, the dart that tops was in a different post go, but the Four double ten was brilliant. Great adjustment. And this fifth set sees Harms take a two-one lead. One on right. Bobby George said this was going to be tight. Bobby's never wrong. One on right. This holds here. It couldn't be tighter. The game has ebbed and flowed. The former electrician has never blown a fuse. Six day. It's kind of stuttered, hasn't it? More than ebbed and flowed. It's been moments of brilliance and then moments when the pair of them have just not been able to hit the one on proverbial one. Uh, rear with a banjo. One on right. No spectacular finishes. Now the best so far, 123 from Harms in the second leg of the first set. Sixteen. One on one. Good last dart, squeezing that one in with a much needed treble. Eighty-one. So one forty-one for Eccles. Be the best finish of the match so far if you could do it oh dear that's the one great dart 68 and loose last Where's one the Uruguay, 160. hits the first treble didn't hit the second one on right so eccles Tony with Uruguay, the chance to square up the match on 73 leaves tops Yeah, oh, good dart! Good dart from Eccles. It's 2-2. Two, two. Nip and tuck. The leg now to decide this fifth set. Sixteen. Just to underline how close these two guys have been to each other. Apart from the first set, every set has gone to the decisive leg. And in all of those deciding legs so far, the man with the darts has won it. 59. So history would dictate that Wesley would take a 3-2 lead here, but you never know. Eccles keeps throwing 59, then I think there's every possibility that would be the case. Let's see what he can do this time. See if he can find the trebles, find the lipstick. There's one. And two. One, That's what the doctor on it. Maximum number four for Tony Eccles. The 125th maximum of the tournament isn't quite followed by number 126. It's followed by a 140 instead. Still nip and tuck between these two in the crucial deciding leg of this fifth set. One on the end, 20 He's got his iron now. Good thinking. One, three, four, and a chance to take this against the dart for Eccles. Is he going to stay up or is he going to take a look at the bottom? He's coming down. Another one needed for double sixteen. Simon Whitlock always favours that way of going for one, three, four. 20s, 18s, the more 82. logical and the more normal Where's route. But he's in a good position. Harms now needs this. 84. Great start. Double 12. Double six for the set. Yeah, and it's been shot. Now there's some emotion from the Dutchman. Wesley Harms knows just how important that double six was. He's hit it. And it's 3 2. Couldn't afford to miss that and let Eccles. 
come back in with a chance to take the set against the dance. Great shot under pressure. Decisive leg once more going with the darts. Three to two. One more now. And that would take the match. But Eccles, first visit here. And if you were a betting man, which of course I would never go down that route, but if you were a betting man, you'd certainly think this is going to go into the decider, wouldn't you? 57. Get divorce and Jackie, his famous fan, discussing what might happen over the uh, next 15 85. 20 minutes here. Can't that's take a, their eyes off it. That's the Dutch contingent, is it? Belgian. I beg your pardon. One on one and 21. Eighty-one. She's been pensive. She's been smiling. She can't sit now. So she's the tension. Ninety-six. Tony racing into a decent start in this sixth set. Seventy-nine. Tony, you require eighty-seven, 87. for the opening leg. 20 would leave the bullseye. 55. Time on his side, though, just setting up the double 16 finish. 97. Tony, you require 32. Double 16, then. No yeah, problem at all. Short the first Excellent dive from Eccles. Tony Eccles. Second leg, it's Wesley the 21st. Demon. Seventh successive leg of this match, which has gone with the darts. One on right. Went all the way at this stage last year, Wesley Harms, a second round tie against his close friend Alan Norris. And two men in play for the uh, same provincial team in the Netherlands. 18. Wesley won that one 4 3. Then saw off uh, Daryl Fitton in the quarterfinals. Of course, it was uh, Tony's victory in the first round that prevented a one on right. repeat. Harms fitting Lakeside 12 months on. One on the round, Forte. One on the round, Forte. Arms on a finish, Eccles looking to see where he is. And Harms with the advantage, he's got the darts. He's going to have six darts from here at 161. One good last dart, really good. Double 12 required just to square it up. Eccles can do nothing more than hope. And again, it looks as though the throw is going to be decisive here. It's going to go with the darts. Is it? Double six. Likes yeah, this one. Has been shot in the second round. The arm? Coolly Throwing takes like it. One apiece. Three, two, Harms. And a 14 data from Wesley Harms. Six, eight. Be looking to repeat that in this leg or. Better it if he can, you would think that he's have an outstanding chance of moving within a leg of the victory. First of four sets. One on one. Harms breaks here. Eccles is in big, big trouble. There's Nobody will know that more than Tony Eccles, will he? Mind, he said. Good last dart. One on their own forte. Looks as though he's moving into the position where he's thinking he can close this one out, Arms. One on their own forte. That's good. Seven. Needed it. But Arms now. 100 plus. 
Wouldn't that look handy? It's only a single though. 41. One on one. Decent recovery from Tony. 96, 137, 100. After the 60 in his first visit. One on an end, 40. Tony require 108. 108, and the pressure is on big time. Treble 17. For the bullseye. This will be a massive take out of 108 if he hits it. 61. He hit the single three. Harms then, 80 to go 2 1 ahead in what could be the last set. Treble five with his first dart. Tops now. Yeah, oh, a good finish. Used the ball. Having gone into the treble five. 25 left him with tops and that was the result 2-1 only needs one Wesley more leg first. Wesley Arms game on. and he has the win and crucially he has the darts and the last four legs he's had the darts he's won none of them started 5-1 excellent cover dart from Wesley so conceivably, conceivably, this is the last leg of Tony Eccles' career. 41. Maybe a few people who know him say, believe that when you see it. Tynan Weir champion. One on the round, 21. Good record over the years. And still, as he's shown here, able to throw at a very good level. One on the end, four time. Career which has brought him nine ranking titles. A CV which saw a quarter final one place one. here in 2007. And had an elimination to Mervyn King in that match. What he'd he give for what sorry, what he'd give for a 180 here. Ninety-nine. I'll always remember that 2007 Lakeside campaign. He missed three darts to take a 4 0 lead in the quarter final against Mervyn King. Hadn't dropped a set in the tournament up to that point. Missed the darts, lost the match 5 4. 42. Must the Uriquire 167. 167. For the match. Can't be done, no checkout though for Eccles, so Harms will come back. And nicely placed now. Ninety nine. Ninety nine. But it's sixty seven for Wesley Harms for the match. Eighteen for double sixteen. Composes himself. And misses. Well, so Eccles again. 80. Come on, his supporters shout. 80. Tops now for Tony Eccles. To make it 2 2. And yeah, keeping the match alive. The Tony Eccles. At last, I found it, he says to himself. Where's that been earlier? Game on. And with the darts in what will be the deciding leg. Life in the old boy yet. We'll be staying with this match. Even though, uh, we're scheduled to uh, leave the lakeside at quarter pass. We will be here every step of the way with these two gentlemen. Public service broadcasting. It's what it's all about. One on ride. Seven. 
one and one. This is going to be very much what uh, Sir Alex calls squeaky bum time. This is going to be about bottle, about nerve, and who can just hold it together when it comes down to the crucial 86. throw. Is this going to be the denouement so far as Eccles is concerned? Or is he going to take it and keep the match alive? It's as simple as that. 16. Well, if it is to be the last match of his career, last week of his career, it wouldn't have been fitting for it to end on a missed shot at tops in that last leg. 36. Went for the bullseye with that third dart. And he's left himself in a bit of a mess. He's got no finish there. And Harms can move into a controlling position. Treble One 20. Oh, I was just going to say that would be handy. And that's precisely what he's got. Scoreboard tells its own story. Needs to do some damage to the 182 six here. Eight. He hasn't really done it. Nine's might one effectively, one effectively, one effectively one have six at 141 from here. Certainly Tony's going to have to conjure up some majesty if he doesn't. Surveys the scoreboard. 61 left, Wesley. One on the Double 18 Tony, if he comes back. What a quality last dart that was. 122. Oh, great first dart. Another one would leave him at double seven. He's got it. Double seven. The crowd poised. And yes, what a check out that and is. Eccles keeps the match ball. alive. It's three apiece. He roars his appreciation along with his supporters and along with the crowd. That is a superb checkout and a massive pressure. Seven, Why seven, are you thinking of jacking it in, Tony? Treble 18, treble 18, double seven to stay in the tournament. 122, genius. He might not like the motorways, but he likes the checkouts. One on the forty. That was magnificent. Well, if he can follow it up with a 180. One on the round 40. What price this one going absolutely to one the wall. One on the round 40. It's kind of been predestined. Just a reminder, it's the first of three legs, providing you win by two clear legs. If not, we carry on going on, until somebody is two legs clear. If it gets to five all, then we play an all or nothing, sudden death, 11th and final leg. Bullying up on, on right. the stage, and then it really is just down to who can keep it together. I wonder if it'll go as far as that. You could certainly see it happen. Sixty. Must you require 121? Loose first start. 16. Leaves him double 81. top. Just a little late adjustment there from Wesley. Does have the advantage of the darts in this decisive set, of course. 41. Must you require 40? Tens yeah, that's game shot. for the opening the leg of the, the decisive set. Second round gets Tony the throw first, game on. Fifty-eight. Sixty. That checkout from Tony Eccles that took that last set had to be one of the checkouts of the tournament so far. 
two treble eighteens and a double seven. Well, you don't see that too often. One on one. Sometimes, when you're on the point of no return, it can kill you. Sometimes it can bring out the best of you. Yesterday we saw Paul Hogan hitting a ball to stay alive against Scott Mitchell. The magnificent checkout. Tony Eccles, treble 18, treble 18, double seven. One on Wonderful. One. And he'll be coming back with 144. Harms just uh, checking on the maths here. Probably going to come down the board. Leave himself on the even checkout. There you go. Now Eccles, 144. He'll fancy this now. Seventy-nine required. One on oh, the terrific last dance. Hans for two nil. One oh six needed. Great start. Hits the six for double top to move within a leg, and he's missed that shot. Two, tops again. Here's another pressure visit for Eccles. Twenty-two, double eleven. It's not a bad marker. Now this is a big dart. Yeah, that's been shot in the second It was round. huge! Tony Eccles, third leg, it's Wesley the 21st, get him on. Tears in the eyes of his cousin Lynn as she watches in admiration. One Tony one. Eccles doesn't know when he's beaten. He's kept his nerve brilliantly. But gonna still... Going to be a sudden death, this Jim. Every chance every chance unless someone can produce something of extraordinary brilliance one on the nice one wesley it was an epic checkout from tony eccles that set this up <laughs> Wasn't quite as quick as that, but you get the you get the drift. Wasn't far short. Forty-one. One on five. One eighty would be handy here. Bit unlucky. Fifty-five. Well, he's left himself on a bogey number there by uh, going for the ball and hitting a single five. Forty-five. Oh, that was an opportunity going begging, wasn't it? He had a real chance to take that leg by the scruff of the neck there, and just couldn't do it. Nerve ends are jangling. Twenty-six. So a chance against the darts for Tony Eccles, both players on 139, who can take it out the more quickly? 17 will leave tops. What pressure now on Wesley Harms taking out of 139? Well, we've seen how to do it, or one way to do it, can't do it now. 47. Eccles with tops. To take a monumental step towards winning this match. Double ten. Double ten again. Slight adjustment. Yes, he's got him. He's won four legs out of five. And all he has to do now is hold. And he's in the quarter-final for only the second time in his career. Fans were leaping up in acclaim there. They really know their darts here. And when that went in, they knew that despite the fact Four that for much of this match, Harms has looked the likely winner, Eccles is now in pole position. It's his to lose now. His to lose with the darts, looking to serve it out.
Well, he's held 96. in just over two thirds of the legs in which he's had the darts. A reminder that in set six, Wesley was in the same position where he had the darts for the 42. match. Eccles took out a double top. And then in the next leg, had that brilliant 122 to win the set. But Wesley only 42 with his first three darts in a leg he has to win and Eccles replying magnificently. 140. Ooh, he says that he's in a real strong position now. Harms just can't find it when he needs it. That was a good last dart, but he's way, way back. It was a brilliant last dart because he squeezed it in between the other two into a, a gap that seemed inconceivable to hit. But after that 140, Excellent treble 19 with the first start. 69. The cry from the audience a moment ago. You're nearly there, Tony. He knows. He knows how close he is. 13. His arms buckling. Looks like it. They can see Eccles G himself up. Eccles made sure that he was never out of harm's way in this match. Raise of the eyebrows from Wesley. That's the first tell from the poker player that we've seen. Doesn't have the look of a potential winner, does he? And the scoreboard supports the contention because Eccles will come back. And Harms looks as though he's pretty much thrown the towel. Yeah, threw that third one in there. 56 then for the match for Tony Eccles. 16 or 8. It's double 16 for the match. 14. He will be back. The look where Harms is though, 289, and he threw that last dart away in the last visit. And this is all well, a bit right. too late. He's still not on a finish. Turning your requires 16. Only once has he reached the quarterfinals on the Lakeside stage. And this, the last tournament of his career, it's double eight. A sharp intake of breath. Happy birthday, Tony Eccles! Tony Eccles! He's seen off Wesley Harms brilliantly on the ropes, almost past the point of no return. A 122 that will long live in the memory, a brilliant checkout, and then three successive nerveless legs in the decisive seventh set. Wesley Harms, semi-finalist in the last two years, out in the second round. Tony Eccles beats him in a thriller, 4-3. Magnificent dance at the lakeside yet again. Well, ladies and gentlemen, a terrific tussle. Please show your appreciation to both players, Wesley Harms, and through to the quarterfinals, Tony Well, it's Tony Eccles' party, and he can cry with joy if he wants to. He got the perfect 44th birthday present today. The eroticism of Sparky Wesley Harms, 103.5 average in the second. First set, back came Tony Eccles.